Hello everybody, this lesson comes courtesy of Billy Goat Karaoke and his thread reads Hi, I have a text area component that loads external text into it and I was wondering how you control the font size for the text that appears in it. I can't find any font parameters. Do I have to add something to the AS of the external text function? Or what do I need to add? Cheers, Sean. Okay. Well, it comes courtesy of Sean. Sorry. <laughs> All right, so what we'll do is I'm here in a new Flash Action Script 3 file. We'll drag out the text area component in the from the components library. Here's text area, drag it out to stage. And I'm just going to set the size manually. Let's go to about 400 by 200. Let's give it an instance name of TA underscore txt text area underscore txt so ta underscore txt is the instance name on it and now let's put some code here let's make a new layer and on that new layer let's type in a string actually let's type in two strings so I'll show you two different sizes my string one this is a string type variable and We'll also, let's just type in as a value. String value is hello little world. Exclamation. Now let's take that line and copy it. And let's just say you had another value going in. Another external section. Or another section of external text coming in. Let's say hello big world. And normally you would only have one external string coming in. But I just wanted to show you how you could format two of them if you wanted in different ways. Okay, so now let's just write in TA. Let's put in the instance name for that text component, text area component. TA underscore TXT. And we're going to use the HTML property, HTML text property. That way we can have it render HTML in the string. And we're going to say HTML text is equal, and we put everything in between single quotes here. And then we put the semicolon. <clears throat> in between the single quotes, we're going to type in font size, just like you would in HTML. It will now respect your HTML commands or formatting. Let's make this one minus 2 for the hello little world and right here we got to close off that font tag we're going to put after the single quote the last single quote there we're going to put plus space space plus space space and two more single quotes <coughs> now here we're going to type in the closing font tag here and all we have to do is put in my string one right there now we press control enter and you see you have nice little text it says hello little world now all we have to do is you can append text well actually let's just put a line break here br slash close to br and we're going to have font size plus 8. Make it really big. Plus 8. And then we put plus space space plus space space single quote single quote in between the single quote we close the font tag there. There you go. My string 2 goes right there. Now let's press control enter. And there it is. Hello big world and hello little world. This is negative 2 size and this is font size of plus 8. <coughs> and you can do a whole lot more formatting. Say you wanted this one to be underlined. You just pop in the HTML underline tag. 
close it off control enter or F12 in the browser 